Understanding filtering actions. The action. Filtering policies in the smooth water are defined by a set of simple logical parameters. Who, what, where, when, and the action to be taken. Who, what, and where define what will be included in the rule. The action defines the type of filtering the smooth wall will apply and what will be returned to the user. Within web filtering policies, there are six actions you can choose. Create policy folder. This is like creating a policy template you use later, saving your who, what, where, or when settings so that you don't have to duplicate work creating similar future policies. Block displays the block page to the user and does not allow them to access the content. Allow lets the user view the content they have requested. Whitelist tells the system that you trust the site and so no SSL inspection or content modification is required. The Smoothwell filter just trusts the content. This could be used for a trusted supplier such as a company provider's website. Softblock. The block page is shown as a warning that the user should be mindful of the content but the user is able to choose if they would like to stop at this point or choose to click through and proceed to the site. Limit to quota is where the smooth wall allows the content, but only for a set period of time. This allows you to limit content such as Skype, where you may not want to fully block, but you don't want to allow excessive use, which may waste time or use excessive bandwidth. The user will see a page notifying them of the time limit and then be reminded at set intervals. Once the time limit is up, the content will be blocked until the quota resets for the next 24 hours. See the video, Setting up a quota, for instructions on how to create custom quotas. HTTPS encrypted traffic can be operated on in a number of ways, depending on the type of filtering rule you would like to create with it. It's important to install the Man in the Middle certificate on every client as a trusted root certificate authority, as the Smoothwall will use this certificate authority to generate certificates pretending to be the site the clients are going to. This allows the smooth wall to see the full content of the encrypted session and therefore apply blocking or allows based on the content. HTTPS actions allow you to do one of four things. Create policy folder for creating a policy template to use later. Decrypt and inspect decrypts the site traffic so that it can be filtered in the same way and using the same rules as you would choose for a normal website. This is useful when you need to inspect the full URL. For example, don't block Google, but do block google.com slash games. And it's useful to be able to extract search terms. Validate certificate, which checks the certificate against the certificate authority store, checking that the certificate of the site hasn't expired, but does nothing else. Do not inspect, usually used for things like online banking. The content is not operated on, meaning that the full content requires encrypted and therefore private. You can set to show users a page daily, weekly or never to inform them that their traffic is being intercepted as a warning to users that their browsing is not fully private. Mm -hmm.